be covering not only this third place game here in the B division, but also the third place game for the A division and both championship matches for the A and B divisions here at the Truman Center in Beatrice, Nebraska. Set to the far side, spiked, and Sterling's going to get a free ball. Ball tipped over. And Southern Spike goes out of bounds. First point of this match goes to Sterling. That serve goes out of bounds, score tied up at one. Wymore going to get a free ball. Ball tipped. Not able to drop. Southern unable to save the ball. Back to serve for the Lady Jets is number two, Macy Richardson. She somehow hits one of the hits one of the Southern players, and the ball goes out of bounds, resulting in an ace for Richardson. Nice hard serve, and that's two aces in a row. Spike goes off the block, able to drop in for a point for Southern. Back to serve for Southern is number 16, the libero, Madison Wagner. Back to the middle, and that is a kill for number 14, Colby Tees. Sterling going to get a free ball. Set far side. They're able to drop the ball in for a kill. Ella Wingert with that kill. Set in the middle, and Sterling able to save the ball. And a nice kill for the Lady Raiders. Current score, Sterling Lady Jets six. Southern Lady Raiders, three. That's sort of barely able to get over the net. And a point for the Jets. Ah! 
And that is going to be an ace for number 14, the 6'2", senior, Colby Tees. And she gets yet another ace. He's serving to the net. Lady Raiders now down by five. That serve goes out of bounds. Bell Hainer's serve. Able to get over in that. And a little bit of miscommunication by the Southern Raiders. Give Sterling to get Sterling up by seven. Get mid, and they're going to say that ball landed in inbounds. Shelby Satoff with the kill, and back to serve for the Lady Raiders. Number 10, Lauren Tarnick. Macy Richardson with the kill. Ball goes out of bounds with some more miscommunication by the Lady Raiders. And a timeout has been called by Southern. Midland's mission is to inspire people to learn and lead in the world with purpose. Welcome you back here between the Lady Jets and the Lady Raiders. Good recovery by the Lady Raiders. Not letting that ball drop. Spike from the back row. Ball goes out of bounds. And that puts Sterling Lady Jets up by nine here in this first set. That spike goes out of bounds. And another point for Sterling. Some more miscommunication by the Lady Raiders. Set far side. And the spike goes out of bounds. Putting the Lady Raiders down by nine. Score, Lady Jets 15, Southern Lady Raiders six. Net violation called on the Lady Raiders. Point for the Sterling Lady Jets.
Miscommunication there. And Sterling able to get the ball over. Good set, ball tipped. Set to the back row, Spike. Good rally by both teams, but Sterling able to come out on top. Missed tip by the Lady Raiders. Puts the Lady Jets up by 12. Short serve. Tipped over by number 12, Katie Wusk. And another timeout for the Lady Raiders. And as they take a timeout, we'll take one as well. Thank you for tuning in. It's thanks to you that we're where we are today. We're proud to watch these communities grow because they're our communities too. Our neighbors, our friends, it's where we live. These are all our hometowns. And no matter what, the people who will continue to serve your needs with the hometown support you know and trust are just down the street. Cornerstone Bank, growing together. Welcome you back to Beatrice, Nebraska, here after that second time out here in this first set. The Lady Jets up by 13 with a score 19 to six over the Lady Raiders. Lady Jets going to get a free ball. Set far side. Good spike and kill for number 12, Janessa. Cooper. And we would like to thank our sponsors, Midland University, Truck Center Company, and Cornerstone Bank for allowing us to broadcast this great tournament. Ball spiked into the block and goes out of bounds. Point for the Lady Jets. Good serve. <laughs> that ball goes out of bounds. Back to serve for Sterling is number two, Macy Richardson. And that's going to be an ace for Richardson. Another great serve by Richardson. And that ball spiked out of bounds by the Raiders. Short serve. Able to be dug and managed to recover. And Wymore able to magically get a point off of that. Some miscommunication by the Lady Jets. Wymore with a great recovery with some nice hits off the net and able to get it over. That and what a kill by number eight, Kaylee Clover, the 5'9 junior for Wymore Southern.
That's set a little too far. Sterling able to get a block on it. Serve goes out of bounds. And it sets the Lady Jets up for a set point here in this first set. Ball blocked and able to drop down for a point for the last point here in this first set for the Sterling Lady Jets. At the end of the first set, Sterling Jets able to come out on top with a score of 25 to 10. My name is William Scarf. I'm a diesel tech here in York, Nebraska for Truck Center Companies. Before I started working here, I uh, helped uh, the smaller mechanic shop and uh, I did some work here and there. And then I started working on some engines at, my, at home in my shop. And then uh, that's when I kind of got my jump with diesel. Um, I've liked the experience they're giving me, um, the hours they're able to give me and uh, just the training um, and all the accessories. Pay is good, benefits are wonderful. Um, basically, they, they offer basically all benefits. Pretty happy that I was able to find it so quickly, right after uh, high school, basically. Um, it was a really jump right into it, and um, it turns out to be a really good place to start a career. Midland's mission is to inspire people to learn and lead in the world with purpose. today. We're proud to watch these communities grow because they're our communities too. Our neighbors, our friends, it's where we live. These are all our hometowns. And no matter what, the people who will continue to serve your needs with the hometown support you know and trust are just down the street. Cornerstone Bank, growing together. We welcome you back here for the start of the second set here between the Wymore Southern Lady Raiders and the Lady Jets from Sterling. Richardson able to tip the ball over the net. First point of the second set goes to Sterling. Low set. And they're going to say that ball went out of bounds. Another good serve by Richardson. Spike from the back row. Set far side. And blocked into the ground. Point for the Lady Raiders. Back to serve for Southern is Madison Wegner. Set to the middle. Tipped. And they're going to say that ball lands in. Go, 
Ball tipped over and able to drop in for a point for Sterling. Set to the middle. And that spike goes out of bounds. Southern now down by three. Sterling with five, Southern with two. Ball gonna be tipped over. Set near side. It's a good dig. And Southern able to get the save. Some miscommunication by Sterling, but they're able to get the ball over. Some good hustle by Sterling, but I'm unable to get the ball over with one too many hits. Wymore Southern now down by two. Ball tipped out of bounds. Southern now down by one. Great serve. Uh, what appeared to be number 12, Janessa Cooper, able to get the ace. And that serve goes into the net. Back to serve for the Lady Jets is number 14, Colby Tees. That serve just clips the net. Just barely managing to get over. And that spike goes out of bounds. Set far side. And some more miscommunication by the Lady Raiders. Bill Hayner back to serve. And they're going to call two touches on the Lady Raiders. Spike goes off the block, but the block goes out of bounds. So point for the Lady Jets. Puts them up by three. Long serve. Manages to land in. Results in an ace for number 15, Bell Hayner. Not enough power on the tip to get over the net. Point for the Lady Raiders. Set far side. Back row spike. It's going to work out. Lauren Trower nicked. With the back row kill. Southern with the free ball set far side. 
And Spike goes out of bounds. Lady Jets still up by three, score now. Lady Jets 11, Lady Raiders eight. for Brittany Frazzi. Puts Southern down by one. This fight goes out of bounds. Point for Sterling. Kelsey Holtus, the libero, serves for Sterling. Lady Jets going to get a free ball. And that spike. Barely managing to land in. Results in a point for the Lady Jets. A little bit of miscommunication. Point goes to Southern. Singleton, short serve. And Kobe Tease able to get the spike and kill. Macy Richardson to serve. And that one goes into the net. That is going to be an ace for number 16, Madison Wegner. Spike nailed into the block, and able to drop in for a point. Timeout called. With that timeout, we'll take a quick timeout as well. Midland's mission is to inspire people to learn and lead in the world with purpose. from the back row. They're going to call two hits on Sterling. Which gives Southern their first lead of the night. Set a little too close to the net. Results in a point for Sterling.
Tip goes over the net. Point for Southern. Back to serve for Southern is number 12, Janessa Cooper. Her serve goes a bit too far. And the score is all tied up at 16. Ball gets tipped over. Point goes to Southern. Back to serve for Southern is number eight, Kaylee Clover. Ball goes into the stands. Kill goes to number three, Ella Wingert. Sterling unable to recover from the miss hit. Puts the Lady Raiders up by one. Set near side. Sterling going to get a free ball. Set in the middle. Point goes to the Southern Lady Raiders. Two hits called on Sterling. Timeout is called. And with that timeout, I think I should go ahead and go over the schedule following this. So following this game is, at 5 o'clock is the third place game for the A division here between HTRS and Meridian. Following that game, the championship game in the B division Palmyra versus JCC at 6.30. And following that game at 8 o'clock is the A Division Championship game between Diller Odell and BDS. And we really hope you stay tuned for those games. Current score, Southern 19, Sterling 17. Sterling with 1-1 one, one set right now. Back row Spike. And Spike goes into the net. Lady Raiders now up by three. Back to serve, number 10, Laura Trauernick. Low serve, able to be recovered. Good attempt for the dig, but the ball goes out of bounds. Southern now up by five. Set in the middle, and two hits. Called on Sterling.
Set far side. Spike into the net. Sets up set point for the Lady Raiders. Try our next serve. And point goes to Sterling. It appeared Trower next stepped on the line. Ella Wingert back to serve for the Lady Jets. All tipped over and a lift called on the Lady Jets. And that's going to end it here in set two. Both teams have currently won a set. Sterling winning the first set, 25 to 10, while Wymore coming back and winning the second set, 25 to 18. And with that, we'll take a quick break. Thank you for tuning in. Midland's mission is to inspire people to learn and lead in the world with purpose. today. We're proud to watch these communities grow because they're our communities too. Our neighbors, our friends, it's where we live. These are all our hometowns. And no matter what, the people who will continue to serve your needs with the hometown support you know and trust are just down the street. Cornerstone Bank, growing together. My name is William Scarf. I'm a diesel tech here in York, Nebraska for Truck Center Companies. Before I started working here, I uh, helped uh, the smaller mechanic shop and uh, I did some work here and there. And then I started working on some engines at, my, at home in my shop. And then uh, that's when I kind of got my jump with diesel. Um, I've liked the experience they're giving me, um, the hours they're able to give me and uh, just the training um, and all the accessories. Pay is good, benefits are wonderful. Um, basically they, they offer basically all benefits. Pretty happy that I was able to. Here we are, start of the third and final set here in the Budecus tournament here between Southern and Sterling. Back row spike. Ball blocked and able to drop in for a point. Colby ties. Able to get the block. Macy Richardson to serve for Sterling. Ball goes off the block, and then able to drop in for a point for Southern. Nice low serve. And number 10, Lauren Traranik, able to get the kill. Set near side, off the block and drops for a point. Score now tied up at two. 
Serving for Sterling, Katie West. Another spike off the block. Able to drop for a point. Vanessa Cooper. Good serve. Here, and Macy Richardson slipped. Results in a point for Southern. Spike off the block. And this time, the block goes Southern's way. Ball tipped over. Set far side, tipped over, drops in for a point. Callie Cooper with the tip over the net. Must have been some type of formation error for Sterling. This now puts Southern, the Lady Raiders, up by five. Bump goes a little too far. Southern with the free ball and able to capitalize off of it. The Southern Lady Raiders now up by six with the score of eight to two. Echo spike. And they're going to call a net violation on number 14, Colby Ties. That near side. Yeah! Off the block and the ball's able to drop. Ties to serve. Nice slow serve, drops in for his second ace in a row. Free ball for Sterling. Set far side. Gets tipped over. And a point for Sterling. Two hits called on the Lady Raiders. The Lady Jets now down by three. All blocked. Able to be recovered. Tipped back over. Blocked again. Ball's tipped over. Sterling with a free ball. Going to spike it. And Southern. Miscommunication by the Lady Raiders. 
Sterling now down by two. Katie Bolt unable to get the dig. Southern and Sterling's great run. Sterling now down by three. Lady Raiders 10. Lady Jets seven. Make that Lady Jets eight as that serve goes out of bounds. Long high serve, lands on the line, puts the Lady Jets down by one. <laughs> Bell Hayner. <laughs> Two hits called on the Lady Raiders. Puts the score tied up at 10, and with that, we'll take a quick timeout. Midland's mission is to inspire people to learn and lead in the world with purpose. Set far side, Spike goes out of bounds. They're not going to say, they are going to say the ball was tipped. They're going to say the ball's tipped. At the point, should go to Sterling. Bell Hainer served. It was a bit too far, and the score is now tied up at 11. Back to serve for the Southern Raiders. Number 10, Lauren Trauernick. Ball tipped over. Set near side. And Macy Richardson. Gets the kill. Now serving for the Lady Jets, number three, Ella Wingert. That back row spike goes into the net. That puts the Lady Jets up by two. Good serve. And that spot goes out of bounds. Lady Jets now up by three. Low serve goes into the net. Back to serve for Southern. Number 11, Brady Frazzi. And that serve goes into the net.
Spike goes out of bounds, and they're not going to say the ball is tipped. Recurrent score, Sterling 16, Southern 12. A little bit of miscommunication. Results in a point for Southern. Cambry Singleton back to serve for the Lady Raiders. Two hits, call on the Lady Jets. Sterling somehow able to recover from that. Tipped over. And Southern's going to get a free ball. Set far side. Spike off the net and lands inbounds for the Lady Raiders. Southern now down by one. Serve goes off the top of the net and drops in for an ace. Set far side. Off the block, and Southern able to recover. Set far side. Ball tipped over. Bumped up, tipped to the back corner. And miscommunication by Sterling. Southern now up by one. Timeout called by Sterling. That time will take him as well. Midland's mission is to inspire people to learn and lead in the world with purpose. back here in the third and final set here in this third place B division game here in Beatrice, Nebraska. The Southern Lady Raiders up by one with a score of 17. Make that 18 as they're able to get that kill. Ball tipped over. Spike goes into the net. Lady Raiders now up by three. Still serving for the Lady Raiders, number one, Cambry Singleton. Back row spike, goes out of bounds. <laughs> 
Set far side. And Sterling unable to get the ball tipped over. Lady Raiders now up by five. High serve. Set far side. And set just a bit too far. And another timeout for Sterling. As we'll take a timeout. We'll take one as well. It's thanks to you that we're where we are today. We're proud to watch these communities grow because they're our communities too. Our neighbors, our friends, it's where we live. These are all our hometowns. And no matter what, the people who will continue to serve your needs with the hometown support you know and trust are just down the street. Cornerstone Bank, growing together. Back after the timeout. Lady Raiders now at 23. All the Lady Jets are at 16. That bump goes up a bit short. Miscommunication by the Lady Jets. Results in match point for the Lady Raiders. Short serve, set far side, spike. Like off the block. And the Lady Raiders from Southern are able to come out victorious here in this third place match of the B Division. So congratulations to the Southern Lady Raiders. They're getting third place here in the Budecus Volleyball Tournament in the B Division. But still, hard, hard fought game between both teams. Well played for both teams.